Hello, welcome back to my channel. Are you guys ready to put some color on this car? Let's get to it. Let's continue with this build. Next is painting the inside of the cab. I'm going to show you how I'm going to be taping it up so uh, you don't get any hard lines, hard edges, whatever you want to call it. So let's just get to it. I do have some uh, plastic sheeting that I'm going to be using to cover the entire car and just leave the opening that's going to be painted. Here it is. The so first thing that I did, just covered it up. Covered the entire car up. Then we can just start by trimming what we need. What we need for it to be exposed. First of all, all I did, got the knife, cut the, cut the door out. Cut it out. I'm going to use this same plastic to cover the door. I'm going to be doing the same thing on this side. Let me show you how I'm going to mask it. This is why you remove everything. This is called back masking. I'm putting the tape on the back side of this uh, uh, door. I'm going to do it all the way around. Then I'm going to come back, put that uh, plastic sheeting, cover it up, and it'll be covered. All I'm going to have to do is just trim it out. All the tape has been applied back masking it now I'm gonna start putting this uh, plastic sheeting cover up the door there it is it's covered now this plastic that's left over what I'm gonna do I'm gonna get myself the razor blade put it next to the to the body panel and just call cut all the way around it'll cut smoothly And there it is it's been trimmed it's nice covered let's do the other one now to cover up the top I used the fine line tape right where the holes of that molding is remember there's a big chrome molding that goes here that's where I'm gonna cover the the seam so I'm gonna use the fine line tape tape this up and I'm gonna be painting this from here down everything's gonna be painted down you're not even gonna know that it's there because the moldings about this big so it's gonna cover everything there you go everything is cleaned I already did this side everything is covered and I also did the wax and grease remover just to clean everything up I did spray some adhesion promoter on the bottom because uh, the bottom piece is plastic but we're good to go this is this side let's spray that sealer
the sealer has been applied the reason I'm applying sealer is because it's gonna get totally different color right there so now I'm gonna let it sit for about 10 to 15 minutes and uh, come back start applying that uh, that base for that uh, three-stage pearl let me show you the color I'm gonna be using the brand so that uh, you see what I'm using this is the brand that I'm using right there this is a base and it's Starfire uh, pearl but there it is I'm also gonna be using high Q clear coat so let's just mix it up put it in the gun start applying it one coat down I'm gonna be applying three coats three coats of base so uh, let me just uh, wait about 10 15 minutes for this to dry apply two more coats then I'll bring you back once the third coat has been applied to it I can show you how I'm gonna be spraying the pearl three coats of base now what's next is that pearl let's just mix it up apply the pearl then the clear and we're we'll be done with the inside once the car is in this stage where i'm painting it's going to go a lot quicker the hardest part is the prep guys the prep is the hardest part and it's neat and it needs i'm sorry it needs to be done correctly here's a pearl right there it's mixed one to one one part of pearl, one part of reducer. Let's mix it up, put it on the gun, start applying it.
There it is. I applied two coats of pearl and we're good to go for the clear. It's so pearly. The clear I'm going to be using is from High Q, High Solids Clear 5300. there it is I applied three coats of clear and after a couple of hours of drying we're good to go the inside is done just gonna wait until tomorrow so I can unmask it and uh, start on the hood and trunk but this will be it this will be it for this video guys thank you very much I hope you enjoyed it and uh follow my uh channel subscribe to my channel hit that little bell icon so you can be notified whenever i upload a video also there's more videos to come thank you guys like always stay safe and god bless mm -hmm.